Hey y'all, 2022 Pigeon Forge Rod Run, Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. And uh, coming to you from live on load-in day. So not everything is set up just quite yet. And um, I wanted to try to find somebody that'll tell us a little information. Maybe we can run into Uncle Rod and he can tell us something about uh, ticket prices, this, that, and the other thing. And um, so that's what we're doing live from load-in day at the Pigeon Forge Rod Run 2022. Give just a, a few minutes for some people to get in here. Y'all see me without my glasses, huh? Because I'm getting old, I'm going blind, and uh, and I don't even know where the camera is. I keep looking over here when I should be looking over here. When I wear my glasses, I don't have to worry about those kind of things. But anyways, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thanks for stopping by. 2022 Pigeon Forge Rod Run, Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. It's going to be a great week. Weather is going to be awesome. And uh, as you will see here in just a few minutes, we have got some fine cars already coming in here. So let me get this camera turned around so we can quit looking at me and let's start checking some things out. There we go. So we're in the vendor area and we are on the, uh, I don't know, stabilizer. So there again, we're still learning out how to use that. But I have to admit, it did make the video look smoother. So there you go. Again, people will be asking the 2022 Pigeon Forge Rod Run. Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. Nice Mopar. It will be Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Oh, look at all these trophies. Let's go over here. Oh, they're going to have a special guest. Is going to be uh, Ralph and Potsy. Speaking of Potsy, what's going on, Uncle Rod? Hey, Scotty D. How you doing, buddy? Outstanding, my friend. How are you doing? Well, we're doing great. Getting ready <laughs> for the big show. Looks like we are going to have bullets weather. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Just trying to uh, trying to make it. <laughs> right, right. But 80s, low 80s, upper 70s, no rain is in the forecast, Bad, knock on wood. Upper 50s at night. Right so on. Everything sweatshirt at fantastic. night. Fantastic. We have sweatshirts. Right on. Back. Right. But, uh, and you got forward. hoodies. Don't forget you got hoodies, too. We do have hoodies. Right, I we heard. I didn't see one. and everything, but we're looking forward to getting uh, Don Most and Anson Williams in. These guys are fantastic. I worked with them two or three years ago, and they are just great. So, uh, they will be here, all the cool cars, the vendors, everything, and uh, of course, three great days, $15 a day. Plus, you could come in, you get a free ticket to register for the toolbox that Atomic Speed Shop is giving away. I mean, it is fantastic. Right. You can check it out. Now, do you register for the show or just by coming in as a uh, well, buying a ticket? You, once you buy a ticket and come into the show, they'll have a free ticket to register and drop in. The okay, so go buy and see them, go and that's how you register. Them. Right on. Plus, if you have a hot rod project coming up while you're there, talk to them. Sure, sure. Great builders. Right. So, uh, yeah, looking forward to everything. So, let's uh, What about all them trophies behind you? Well, that's the top 25, the ultimate five, which if you win one of these right here, pretty special. Boy, those are beautiful, aren't that they? That is uh, Something I'd like to shout out to Josh Welch, Chop Chop. They helped me with these. They are just fantastic. We have the regular trophies for motors all the way up to the people's choice. So, uh, yeah, we have got, look at what's around here. We're still bringing cars in. Right. But when you come in in the morning, we will be full and ready. Right on. Plus sunshine. Right on. And what ticket prices are $15 a day? 15 per day. Children are 12 free. Can you buy like a weekend pass or anything? You can. Does that save you any kind of money? It does. Save you about $10. Okay. Yeah. And is there a website or something people wanted to go to that they might get yeah, information on? The Pigeon Forge Rod Run website is uh, good. And of course the, the Facebook page we Pigeon Forge Rod Run. Okay. And I put a lot of information on it. And as always, come by and see ET Motor Gear early because you'll run out of sizes and colors and all that before the weekend's we out. Three locations, two in the show, one at six. So if you're cruising the strip or whatever, stop by and see those guys up there. Right on. Anything else we need to get out to them? Well, we're just looking forward. We'd like to have everyone out. And, of course, come by and see the guys, get your picture made. There's no charging. Connection. There we go. We're back. Sorry about that. As Rod was saying, Uncle Rod was saying there when we got disconnected, 
Um, to get an autograph from uh, Ralph Mouth or Potsy is uh, doesn't cost anything. They've paid to bring them in here and all that. So that's taken care of. Again, these are the, some of the trophies that will be available. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And let's go. Uh, let's go check What's out. Up, hey, how you doing, brother? Hey, man. How about you? Good, good. Got a few uh, first generation. Look at these. Two of these. And I'll try to get a better walkthrough, you know. But I wanted to get on today and just invite everybody out, let them remind them that uh, that the uh, Pigeon Forge Rod Run is going on this weekend. If you're not into hot rods, then this is probably a weekend to stay out of Pigeon Forge because the traffic will be horrendous. It always is. But, man, it's worth it. Look at that, would you? Again, it looks like it's going to be a great show. Cool cars, good vendors. You know, the LeConte Center is at one end and the uh, uh, the island is at the other. So there's all kinds of restaurants. The Ferris wheel's down there. Paula Deans is down there. And I'm giving Paula a shout out. She doesn't even give me free lunch, but it's that good. Nice car there that uh, Riffies did. Holcomb put an interior in. We haven't done a feature on it yet. Still trying to get that all set up. Nice Mopar. Everything's here. You got Fords, you got Chevrolets, you got Mopars. You know, you got trucks, you got cars. And this is just the inside. There's uh, there's a swap meet that's outside. There'll be thousands of cars in town. There'll be cars out in the parking lot. It's just, uh, I don't know how long it's been going on. A long time. 40 years long time you'd think i've been i've been doing this show for a while shout out to a few of the sponsors jerry rice's uh, chevelle is the feature car it's not here yet but uh built by bobby alloway very cool car that will be the feature car and again keep in mind we're not all loaded in yet but piddles back at the cabin and i got to get back up there i left at 11 o'clock so I can't leave her too long. So that's why I'm doing this now. That's a cool car. Plain, but cool. Hey, you know, this is it's just, it's just one in person. I always love to come see. It's Tom. Hey, Big Daddy. You got time to tell people about your products? Yes, sir. What do you got going on here? Man, we, we getting ready for the ride, right? Right, 2022, uh, it's, Fall it's Pigeon down. Forge, yeah. right? And uh, you got the Big Daddy display here, yes, one sir. of the vendors, one of the uh, ones. All right, sorry about that. We had a little disconnection from my boy Tommy. You got, what What do you got going on? I've just got our, you know, all of our ceramic products, ceramic detailer, waterless wash, ceramic shampoo. Simple sealants, got the new tire shine, the you know the yeah. original uh, grip and wet tire shine. Right. Got a few new things. Got a new. And what's that? What's that stuff that I'm crazy about? The detailer. The, what's that called? The, the ceramic detail. This stuff right here. Let me tell you, folks. That stuff right there, I put on the Yukon down at uh, cruising the coast, and I couldn't lean on it. I kept sliding off and falling. Did I or did I not call you, you complaining? Did call me, yeah. I called you on a Saturday afternoon complaining. I'm like, Tommy, what'd you he's sell like, me? He said, I can't stay on <laughs> I my truck. I can't even lean on my truck. It's well, the end of the, the week. Good, the good thing, it lasts about six months. Did it, it last forever? Spray on, wipe off. See, I didn't even tell you that whole part. Yeah. It sat outside for six months, got hauled on a trailer, open trailer, rain, dirt, all that. I hit it with a hose, dried it off, and I was on my way. Yeah. Crazy stuff. And so, you get here, your car's dirty, or you need a professional, because Tommy's a professional. He can always answer questions and do all that for you, too. We can handle it. Brother, I appreciate Man, it. Thank you, yep. Scott. Thank you. One of my good friends, Tommy McLean, owns Big Daddy. He sells Wizard, and he sells other stuff. Tommy's really honest. So, if somebody else has a better product, he'll tell you, use this one. But if he makes a better product, then, of course, that's what he's going to recommend. But look at some of these cars. This one we did a feature on just a couple of months ago at Holcomb's. It was just finished up at Holcomb's. Keep in mind, I'm still trying to figure this thing out. That's that one that's got the ZL1. You got this truck here. That's clean. It's getting ready. Look at that Chevelle. 454, coll-inducted, rally wheels, wide ovals. That's the car right there anybody 
And again, they'll have uh, Ralph Mouth and Potsy here signing autographs. Look at this, an original Z01 Camaro. Number 57 of the 69 that they made. They made two yellow ones. That's one of the yellow ones. So, and let me give Uncle Rod a big shout out because he does what you're looking for. Those are the event trailers. So if you're up here and you want an official Rod Run apparel, t-shirt, souvenir, that's where you get them. Again, inside you have a bunch of vendors. You got a bunch of cool cars. And then outside, there's more vendors and more cool cars. Absolutely beautiful weather. I keep getting disconnected, folks. So I don't know if that's the traffic in the area or if that's me being in the building. I'm on a cell instead of switching over to the Wi-Fi. I might, might do that tomorrow. But uh, I'll be up here all weekend, in and out. Uh, I don't have any kind of commitment, so I can't give you an exact time. But uh, please, come up to the Pigeon Forge Rod Run. Been going on a long time. You'll have a fun time, I guarantee 